four things you should never ever say to a woman when you guys are in the zaza room doing the do never you say these four things to her number one is never force a woman to scream or make noise while you are doing the do with her when you guys are doing the do let her do it willingly let her do it because she wants to do it. Let her do it because she's enjoying it. Don't ask her, baby, baby, scream now. Baby, scream now. You know, when you scream, uh, you know, she will not start doing all those fake things. Ah, oh, baby, why are you not screaming? Scream now, you know. But no. Let her be real. Because sometimes when a woman do that, when she does that, maybe she will start screaming because she has her to sleep. She will say, ah, hey. You would think because oh she oh she's enjoying no she's faking it and when the woman fake it you find out sometimes you won't know why a woman just block you or she just walk away you'll be like oh after the first or after dating her for some time she just walk away it's because you are forcing her to enjoy it you are forcing her you are making her pretend to enjoy it so try to learn skills that will make her when you are doing it touching those spots you know those spots when you touch it she will scream willingly she will scream because you are touching those places she will scream because you are hitting the right spot she will scream she will not scream because you ask her to scream she will not shout because you say baby shout now no she will shout because you are doing the right thing number two things you should never ever tell a woman why you are doing the do is never ask her baby are you enjoying it while you are doing it tell me are you enjoying it the answer is always yes because she knows that when she say no whether she's enjoying it or not she will tell you yes because she knows when she say no it will kill your morale so you are not going to get honest answer unless you want to get the fake answer but if you want to get an honest answer from a woman allow her to settle that's after you people have finished doing the do you have done all the do you have settled down maybe you are relaxing with a bottle of wine that is the right time to now ask her did you enjoy it do you love the way i give it to you or do you need me to improve you can also ask her to improve you need to improve that is the right time and you have to do it playfully you have to say it politely like let it be like you guys are having fun you don't just have to say it by being blunt or say it angrily you have to say it let her know that look you really want her to improve in this area and then you ask her if there's if you do it well at that point she will give you the right answer because that's the right time to ask her not when you are doing it when you are still doing it she will always give you the fake answer she will always give you answer that 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 is yes she will always say yes because she knows you are you are doing it and once she say it it might even end the whole thing if she say oh i'm not enjoying it she, it might even end the whole thing so try the skills that you have learned do the do that you have learned teach her the skills so during the do do so many styles so that when you finish and that's when you now ask her are you enjoying it you will get an honest answer do not ask her during the doing when you guys are still riding now another another thing she never ask a woman when you are doing the do maybe you have arrived now most times it take a woman time to arrive so maybe you have arrived during the do because sometimes men especially those ones that come quickly they will arrive early so when you have arrived you now ask her, ah, baby, have you come? Have you arrived? You know, that kind of question, she will fake it. She's going to fake it. Because you have come, you're not asking her, are you come? Did you come? She will say yes, because if she keeps saying no, 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 every time you guys do, they do, you feel like, ha, you're not, in fact, you'll kill your moral. So don't, don't ask her that question. Have you come? Let her be the one to tell you, oh, I really enjoy this. Uh, you made me come. Hi, ah, you took me to climb, whatever. You took me to the highest point. You did this to me. Let her be the one that will sing the praises. Do not ask the question, whether during or after. Do not ask her the question because you might not get the honest answer. Most time, when she say no, you feel bad. You feel like you have not done your own job because you have come, she has not come. So the best thing is to let her wait for her to say it. If she doesn't say it, 
do not ask her. It's not necessary. Okay? Because imagine when she tell you, ah, why did you come quick? I say, ma, maybe you, you are the type that come quick. She say, why do you come? Why do you like come quick? You feel very embarrassed. So when you tell your mom, why? Why? why, why, why oh, oh, eh, eh, have you arrived? And she say no today. Tomorrow again, have you, did you arrive? She say no. The next one, you say, did you come? No. She say no. You now start looking at her. Ah, maybe she, she has high sex drive. Or maybe she can never be satisfied. No. Do not ask her. Let her be the one to sing your praises. And then finally, never ask a woman, why, huh, why are you dry? Why is Andy dry? Why are you dry? Oh, you are dry, you. Nah, with all this thing, you are still dry. It's your job to make that place. When you touch her at the right places, oh, when you touch her at the right places, that place will not be dry. So never you ask a woman, why are you so dry? Why is that there dry? Ah, this is not like so. It's like you don't love me. It's like you no longer love me. It's like you're not feeling me. She will start feeling like there's something wrong with that. This woman will start wondering why. Why is that place dry? So you have to waking her up. You have to. That's why it's good to play first. Play those play that people who are in relationship play. Before you now start, you do. don't just be the man. I say, oh, you just do, remove everything and, and start doing the do. No, don't be that man. You have to start with, even start early, giving her sign. You will hug her. You just start early before you now start doing. So when when they start, that's why it, it's good to start playing first. Touch those places that will make our body awake. Everywhere will be open for you. So you won't need to say, why are you dry? It's because you have not done the job. You have not touched every point that will make her now start even begging you to come because that place is water, water everywhere. It's juicy. You understand what I mean? Yeah, that's what I mean. So you have to do some foul play, especially if your girlfriend is one that 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 down there is always dry. Me that you have not done your job very well. You have to also wake her, put her in the mood, let her be in the mood, so that you already in the mood. When you put her in the mood, you enjoy it more because everything will be going smoothly and there will not be any hindrance. So you won't, there won't be any need to say why are you dry. Imagine you have small cucumber and she say why do you have small cucumber. That is not good. That's not a good place. A good question for a woman to ask you. You feel very embarrassed. So that's how she will feel when you ask her why that place dry. Be as if she she has a problem or something is wrong with her. So that is it. These are the four things you never ask a woman. Just enjoy it. Let her allow her to enjoy it. No question. If she wants to scream, she wants to sing, she wants to whisper. Doing the do is okay. Let her whisper. Some people whisper. They talk. They call you sweet names. They they sing. They scream so leave her when you are hitting the rice or she will scream never you ask her all those questions you guys to enjoy it do it very well and enjoy it and at the end of the day if she enjoy it she's gonna sing your praises i'm gonna be seeing you again everyone i'm gonna be seeing you kings i'm gonna be seeing you queens bye